Well, first of all, I want to welcome all of you and kind of give you a background. New Chicago Innovation Fest is, as I mentioned, a month-long celebration of entrepreneurship and discovery here at the University of Chicago. Over the next four weeks, there will be more than 40 events, both in Chicago and across the world, and perhaps in different universes as well. We're covering everything, I got to tell you. It's going to highlight innovation, all the cutting-edge research that we have going on here at the university, the entrepreneurial activities of our students, our faculty, and our staff. I encourage all of you to take a look at your Innovation Fest booklet and find a few events to attend. It's a great lineup and there are many exciting things that will be happening here right at the Exchange. For those of you who are here for the first time, the Polsky Exchange is our 34,000 square foot co-working space. As part of the Polsky Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation, the Exchange houses our incubator and state-of-the-art fabrication laboratory. It's here in this building and across the whole campus that we drive the creation of new businesses and ventures at the University of Chicago and on Chicago's South Side. At the Polsky Center, we help our startups and researchers access capital, identify talent, find space, build prototypes, and plan for the growth of their businesses. And in fact, we've jump-started more than 250 of them, including Grubhub, Braintree, and Simple Mills, just to name a few. At the same time, our faculty, including some in this room, are working to develop new ways to clean up oil spills or find relief for millions of migraine sufferers like the work Dr. Richard Craig is doing with Surratt Therapeutics, which you'll hear about a little bit later. We have faculty like Kathy Nagler, Jeff Hubble, and Jack Gilbert, who are the forces behind two different companies targeting the microbiome as a treatment for food allergies. Or Dr. Wen Bin Lin, who took his cancer immunotherapy company, Remo Therapeutics, through our innovation fund and was the recipient of the first UC Go startup license, which is our very simple and expedited licensing process for faculty. I see Stacy Lindau in the room, not sure where you are right now, but she runs a company called Nowpow, very successful graduate of the Polsky Center platform, uh, focused on community-based healthcare uh, applications. So delighted to have her in the room here tonight. The Polsky Center and the University of Chicago as a whole firmly believe that these two pursuits, scientific research, scholarly activities, and the commercial success of companies like Grubhub complement each other. In fact, many times basic research lays the groundwork for future commercial success. This evening, you're going to hear from faculty members that have embarked on this translation journey and how they have utilized the resources here at the Polsky Center to accelerate that process. These researchers have gone through our i program or received an investment from our innovation fund or have worked with our technology transfer team on protecting their intellectual property. For those of you who are considering this pathway, I hope you find this, inf this evening informative and inspiring. Our doors are always open here at the Polsky Center to help you start this journey, which begins with disclosing your idea so we can move your innovation into the patent process and onto the commercial pathway. We have a talented team of professionals here at the Polsky Center ready to assist you. Whether you want to become an entrepreneur or license your work for a commercial partnership with an outside enterprise, the university's tech commercialization and licensing team are here tonight and we'll be happy to answer your questions after this program. Tonight you'll also hear from some of our great partners in innovation here at the University. Dr. Julian Solway of the Institute for Translational Medicine and Dr. Eric Isaacs, the University's Executive Vice President for Research, Innovation and Na National Laboratories. Under Eric's leadership and with strong partners like ITM, we're able to take these ideas, whether they originated in the lab or in a classroom at Booth and turn them into meaningful impact in a big way, impacting Chicago, impacting the world, and impacting these alternative universes out there as well.